Hello all, JT here. We have an exciting signing integration for the Lattice One we think you'll find impressive. It's called Frame. Frame is an Ethereum wallet that runs as a native desktop application with native Lattice One support, and it's a program you download to your PC along with your Chrome or Firefox browser. Today, we'll show you the setup process and execute a simple transaction on Uniswap. Let's get started. The first thing to do will be to head over to frame.sh. After downloading the executable for the client, double click to install. You will get a publisher warning message from Windows. Just click run anyway and proceed to the next step. Once installed, the frame client will appear on the right side of the screen. By default, frame will automatically hide when not in the foreground or focus. You can disable this feature in the settings menu at the top right of the frame panel. Now it's time to add your accounts. Add accounts by clicking on the plus sign at the top. Click Grid Plus Lattice One. Sign into your Lattice One and click Device ID at the bottom of the home page. Enter your Lattice One device ID on frame. Now you'll see a pairing code displayed on the Lattice One. Add this on the frame panel. Now your Lattice Signer configuration is complete. Select the addresses you'd like to interact with and you are ready to go. Now to start using Frame on a browser, head to the Settings menu to install the Frame extension. For this tutorial, we are using Chrome. Now click Approve on the browser extension permission. Disable instances of MetaMask before using the Frame extension, just to avoid conflicts. The easiest way to disable MetaMask or any wallet extension is to simply right-click. Let's do a simple transaction. The first thing will be to click on the Chevron arrow on the accounts you wish to interact with. Let's proceed now with a swap from ETH to DAI on Rinkaby Testnet to show features on both Frame and the Lattice One with the installed ABI pack in place. If you want more information on ABI packs on the Lattice One, head on over to our YouTube channel. Be sure to switch to the Rinkaby Testnet first on the Frame panel. Now head to Uniswap, and in Frame, you will see a notification to approve Uniswap. Click Approve on the connection request. Let's swap ETH for 50 DAI. Simply fill in the fields and then click Swap. Go ahead and approve the transaction on frame and then sign on the Lattice One. Once it is complete, you can check it out on Etherscan. For more information, head on over to gridplus.io or frame.sh. Both communities have Discord for more information. Check us out on Twitter and on Reddit. On behalf of the GridPlus team, my name is JT. Cheers and big hugs from Kansas City.